Welcome to the Music Room. The purpose of this video is to tell you about the room arrangement, where you're going to be in certain situations, and where some of your equipment will be when you come to music. First thing you're going to do most days when you come into the Music Room is you're going to go to the riser and you're going to find your place. I've arranged the room alphabetical order by last name and they are numbered. So if you're number one, you'll be right there. Number two will be there. Number three will be there. Number four will be there. And then the pattern continues all the way down the risers until you get to number 22. Most classes are gonna have 22 people in there. That's why I uh, went to number 22. Uh, odds will be on top, evens will be on the bottom. So that's where we're gonna be in most situations whenever you're in the music room. Now, sometimes we're gonna have things that we're doing, like if we're doing a dance or if we're playing instruments, uh, I might have you spread out so I can see everybody or so that people won't be in each other's way. If I do that, you're going to come out to your floor spot. Right now, the floor spots are marked with a dot that has a number on it. And you can kind of see the numbers there. One is in front, then there's two, then there's three, then there's four. And they are all in front of their riser. Uh, these numbers are not going to be out here the whole year. This is just to help you get used to being at your spot. There are some guides to help you know where to be though. So if your dot's not out here, if you line yourself in front of the riser, and then if you're row one, you're gonna be lined up with that keyboard. If you're row two, you'll be lined up with that keyboard. And you can see row three is lined up with that one, and then row four is lined up with that one. So the dots are there for now to help you get used to where you're gonna be. But later this year, I plan to pull those up and you'll just have to kind of remember uh, your spot on the floor when we're dancing or if we're playing instruments uh, that we need to spread out for. Now, in addition to having uh, a place on the risers and a place on the floor, you also have a keyboard uh, that your group can use. If you're group one, that's gonna be your keyboard. Group two is gonna use that keyboard. And then on that side of the room, that's the one for group three, that's the one for group four, that's the group one for group five, and then that's the one for group six. So every group is gonna have a keyboard in addition to a spot on the risers and a spot on the floor. Now, not only are we gonna use the keyboards uh, to just play the keyboard and learn how to do that, we're also going to use it as an equipment station. You can see that I've got some xylophones down here under uh, keyboard number two. If you were uh, with that group, those would be your xylophones right there. Now, uh, I'll do that whenever we're playing instruments or something like that. So when you come in, if you see instruments underneath your keyboard, it probably means that we're gonna be playing those today. That's just an example. That's why they're the only ones who have them because I wanted you to see that. Now, if we have equipment that everybody's gonna be playing, like if we're all doing the drumsticks and I'm not really worried about how many you get or anything like that, like uh, I'll put them up here at the front of the room where everybody can get to them. Right now, there are headphones. Those will usually be there. Uh, to use with your Chromebooks whenever you come to music so you can hear your music and nobody else can. Uh, this area over here is uh, where I will be. That's my keyboard that I use. That's my computer. That's my mixer. There's my files. That's my desk. There will be a drum set back here. It's not set up yet. Uh, I'm going to ask everybody to stay out of my area. Uh, and that's really all you need to know about that unless you're invited to like play the drums or something. Uh, that's going to be an area for me and not for anybody else. That's just an extra keyboard back there. If people are, uh, there's too many people on these keyboards, then I'll let somebody use that one. Last year it was broken, but I fixed it. So uh, that's a basic idea of how the room is gonna be arranged. You're gonna have a spot on the risers. You're gonna have a spot on the floor. You're gonna have a keyboard and we got a lot of equipment. So uh, I don't think there's really anything else to say. I hope y'all are ready for a great year.